Well, what's up guys? We've got Dave here and I'm just out cruising. This is uh, like the first time it's not been raining all weekend. It just finished raining about an hour ago, maybe hour and a half ago. So I let it dry out a little bit. It's been raining for most of the weekend. So I've just been chilling. It's funny, I was going past that gas station back there and uh, I was thinking about, I just saw a video and this guy was talking about, he goes, like things that you'll never hear a motorcycle rider complain about and one of the things was uh, You'll never hear a motorcycle rider complain about the price of gas You'll never hear him be like oh did you did you see it just went up to like four bucks a gallon or whatever like you'll never hear go for it Like this bike for example, I can go like 75 miles almost 80 miles on two gallons of gas and That's dude. That's gnarly dude. That's better than any hybrid at least as good as any hybrid 40 40 miles per gallon around town that's pretty good and then like the grom dude it gets even better gas mileage i can go like almost 100 miles or, or i think pretty much 100 miles on a gallon yeah like mile per gallon car versus bike it's freaking not even comparable because like say gas is like four four dollars a gallon right now okay say it goes up to six Dude, everyone who owns a car, any one of these people right here, is gonna be complaining. They're gonna be like hating life, dude. Like say it went from $4 to six. All of a sudden, it's like instead of paying $20 to go somewhere, you gotta pay $30 to go somewhere. It's like, dude, that's a lot of money, man. You know, like all of a sudden, you're like spending a lot of money to fill your freaking car up. But all that means to me on a bike like this, <laughs> or on really any bike, you know, is that it's gonna cost $6 to fill it up instead of four dollars to fill it up you know that's all that it, you know that's it's really not that big of a difference you know the difference between four dollars and six dollars is not a big difference but when you're already spending 20 and you don't want to spend 20 and then all of a sudden you got to spend 30 that's a whole different deal man cars are like completely different when it comes to how much gas and trucks are even worse dude but I, I thought that was funny I heard that guy talk about that and he's like yeah you'll never hear a rider complain about the price of gas and that's true <laughs> that is very true I don't even think about gas when I freaking ride my bike yeah it takes me to work and back it takes me one gallon of gas or, or maybe just a little bit more than that and uh, in my car it takes like two or so so it's like in a month, I saved like $100 on gas. And I'm glad I went out and rode. It cleared off so fast, man. It's like the last of the clouds right there. I mean, you could tell it's still kind of wet out, but it cleared off and dried off so fast, dude. But anyway, that's what I had to say about that. Just, I was thinking about that because I passed that gas station. So you guys have a great day. Enjoy the benefits of the extra mile per gallon from your bikes <laughs> versus a car. And I will talk to you later. Peace. Hey, here's to you, California.